So here's the, uh, I'll give you a little rundown on the uh, 2510 that I re restored um, with my father. Uh, it was one of our first ones that we ever did. And I think it was about uh, eight or nine years ago when we started. Uh, so this was uh, the one that got us kind of addicted to restoring tractors. Uh, and then this was the 720. He's, she's parked here for the winter also. But this is the one that I wanted to do first. It's a 1967. Uh, just a synchro uh, eight speed. Uh, it's not the power shift version. It's a diesel and um, I have 13 6 38s on it. I also have a set of rims with 15 5 38s that I can put on too. This is uh, one of the tractors I like to tractor pull with. It's kind of dusty a little bit sitting here, but uh, we'll shine her up in the spring. Uh, it was a full restoration like body was all dented up and scratched and faded and my father did all the body work on it as usual and made it made it nice um, again it's kind of dirty right now but uh, I did have to put a new tachometer in it and I believe fuel sending, gauges, lights, so on. But mechanically, it was, it was good. I did have to redo the injector pump on it. I got that rebuilt. And I put, uh, at the same time, I put four new injectors in it. And uh, I use it to rake hay sometimes. Um... And again, it's tractor pull. I like uh, taking it to tractor pull. It's full stock. There's nothing modified on it. And uh, I've won uh, some competitions with it uh, in our local, at our local fairs and such. Uh, here's some of our winnings up there. So we do okay on uh, some of them. And uh, that's it. Uh, first tractor we restored and still one of my favorites.
And that's a little bit of the history behind my 2510. If you like these videos, uh, please uh, subscribe, uh, give me a thumbs up, and I'll keep um, them coming. Thank you.